Our budgets are all important at our, in our own homes. They're also very important for us at the city. We're looking at how we will invest our dollars, our collective dollars, in 2019 is very important. We hosted our consultation for our community, for Lower Town, for Sandy Hill and Vanny just last week. Good community participation. Some of the themes that were highlighted were transit, were uh, relating to infrastructure, especially Montreal Road, byway market improvements, were related to the environment. Uh, obviously, uh, important climate change situation in terms of winter maintenance, uh, some of those dollars that we need to see, and obviously, some of the, the topics relating to housing. This morning at Council, we had the draft budget presented. That's the way the city will spend the money, $3.6 billion, $1.6 billion of that is from our property tax. Uh, and how we're going to spend that in this coming year. Uh, some of the initiatives are relating to long-term care, youth programs, especially to ensure that our youth don't fall into criminal activities and gangs. Uh, we have some uh, new buses that are being purchased, some new routes that uh, there's uh, an opportunity. I'm still looking at the fine comb of details and stay tuned because there's, there was an important announcement relating to housing. On the housing front, last year, an example of the situation that we have is we've put in policies so that no one sleeps on our streets. And that's very important. No families, no individuals will be left on our streets. We have emergency shelters, we have motels and hotels. Unfortunately, they're overused and folks are staying way too long because we don't have housing options. Councillor McKinney and I were pushing for 1% tax levy. The target there was really to see an, a new housing investments of around 10 to $16 million. I'm happy to report that in this year's budget, in the draft, what we're seeing is $15 million of new housing initiative. What that will do is create more housing targeted this year. My goal is to see targeted towards family first initiatives so that we see a significant reduction of the use of motel and hotel with a four year plan coming later with the term of council priority. In this year's budget, we have the $15 million new housing initiative which will be an amazing opportunity for us to reduce the pressures on our family first motel and hotel use and really have more sustainable stabilization, which are that housing so that the kids can go to school and so that the, the, the family members, so the parents can find employment. Our community budget consultation was well attended. Now that the draft budget is tabled, we, we want your participation at the Budget Speak event. What that is, is our urban councillors uh, public consultation. The two themes this year are housing and transit. We want to get your feedback on the best delivery models for housing. We also want to see what routes should be prioritized in those new buses and new investments in transit. We're waiting for you. Uh, please join us on February 13th at 6 o'clock at City Hall.